So over here, you can see that I have a range of text right here. And let's say what I want to do is I want to go around and replace the uh, word Google right here with all caps. So in that case, what you can do is you can go around over here into edit and over here you can see find and replace is an option. So once you click on this, then what happens is that you can go around and write in what you want to find. In my case, I'm just going to go around and find Google right here. So I'm just going to go around and type in Google just like this. So once I do that, you can see that it highlights out the word Google right here in green. So if I were to go for a small letter, then it does not actually change around the selection. But if I were to click on match case, then now you can see that it only will select out uh, the word that uh, it matches the case with. In, my, uh, in this case, you can see that there's no word with small letter Google right here. So if I were to type in capital, then only then it will be actually selected out right here. So another thing that you can do is you can ignore out um, different symbols over here as well. So over here, I want to replace it out with um, the capital letter Google. So I'm just going to go around type in all caps right here. And if I were to click on replace once, it'll replace out this word. They can click on replace uh, uh, again, then it'll replace out another word right here. You can click next right here again. You can click next or previous, replace, and it replaces it out one by one. You can click on replace all to replace out all the word Google just like this as well. So now I'm just going to go around right here and then paste the Google out. And let's say I'm just going to go around and say a uh, uh, big Z right here. So once I do that, replace all, it replaces every uh, Google word with big Z, as you can see. So let me just go around back onto Google again, just like this, replace all. And now it replaces everything with the word Google again. So that is how you can use the find and replace option inside of Google drawings to refine and replace our text in chunks. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.